what has the biggest challenge you faced in your career been and what did you do to overcome it? I think the biggest challenge that I've had in my career was when uh, the second of my uncles stepped off the board and I stepped into uh, being chairman. The difficulty in that is that you're moving from a dynamic where you had two individuals who had run the business for over 40 years and really fundamentally were playing the role of both a, a governance role as well as an operational role, in a management role in terms of running it. And so all of a sudden, it was a, it was a, it was a significant shift in the dynamics of the board and in the dynamics of the family in, in terms of really a generational transition. Mm -hmm. And so shepherding that, which thankfully I had uh, a huge amount of help from my cousins uh, and my sisters and, and, and uh, mother and father, et cetera, but it was a significant shift. And, and to be in that role as chairman was, was, um, uh, was challenging in, in that sense uh, to, to ensure that we did it smoothly. Uh, and uh, I think we did. I think we did, and we can successfully say we've come out the other side. What I think uh, made it work is, is, is being open about it and building, uh, having, having the conversation about it and, and building a collective vision for what we were trying to do and how to do it. Sort of along those same lines, like that, taking on new leadership responsibility is always a little, at least for me, <laughs> nerve-wracking, right? I mean, how do you get past that? How, when you're coming into a leader, leadership position, how do you grow into it gracefully, would you say? And, and what's a piece of advice you can give there? The biggest things that I've learned uh, is to, one, fundamentally not think that you do or need to have all the answers. I find it to be more powerful to approach a situation uh, if I can get my ego out of the way uh, and, in fact, engage people uh, with questions uh, and an open mind and without a preconceived notion, um, that really helps. It's not to say that uh, you shouldn't have an opinion um, and, and, and at a certain point need to for sure make a judgment and make a call, but uh, to really ap approach it with an open mind and not thinking that you, you, you need to or that you do have all the answers in advance.